Hi, I'm Rob. Today we're going to look at the Arduino Mega and how to add an automated spindle relay to it. You will need a pin header with three pins, you'll need a Maslow board that has the auxiliary one holes in it, and you'll need a relay with connecting wires. To do this you'll need a soldering iron and some solder as well as some side cutters and wire, or wire strippers to cut that pin header. So we need to understand how a relay works. Uh, the relay power controls are on the left. You need ground, you need power, and you need the signal in order to, to run the coil, which will trigger the relay to move. And this particular relay that we're going to use is rated for 5 volts, which means it can be powered by the Arduino itself. Um, the shield on the top um, provides 12 volt power to the motors, but everything else on there is controlled by 5 volts. So our relay needs to be controlled by 5 volts. And so you've got ground and power to run that coil, but your signal pin or your signal wire actually tells it to switch on and off. In the off state, the normally closed would be connected to your switch line. When you power that relay, the normally open then gets connected to it. That's the switch part. So you're going to use normally open and the switch line in or out connections um, to hook up your router. Okay, so here's a, a relay. Uh, you can see there's the connections to the router on the left. The signal pins are, are now in front here with the ground and the N1, N2, uh, and VCC is, is 5 volt power. Uh, the black box shown here is uh, one that's already integrated with the wire sticking out. So what we're going to do is we're going to find the auxiliary one. Um, we're going to cut our pin header to three pins and we'll fit that in the board. This is a version 1.2B uh, Maslow shield right there. And then I have another one that's connected to the Arduino. So we're gonna cut two sets of pin headers. One of those has the heat, heat sinks and the other one does not. So, but in order to solder them on, we have to separate the Arduino from the shield. The Arduino is on the left, the shield is on the right. And once we get that separated, we'll put those pins in and then we flip it over and solder it, but the difficulty is getting the pins to stay in when you flip it over. As we uh, get our solder out, make sure that we basically are all ready to go, but we have to figure out a way to keep those pins from falling out when we solder because those heat sinks are on there. It's kind of hard to, and you can't hold them because they'll burn you. So you set them on top of something that's metal and then do that, but it's easier to just do the one that doesn't have the heat sinks on it. So we flip that board over, hold the pins in place, then we use a soldering iron to heat up the, the actual wire and the joint itself, and then we add a little bit of solder, and then we do each pin. and the auxiliary header is complete. If you want to do auxiliary four while you're at it, you can then use that as your automatic zeroing for your Z axis. And that's another, uh, perhaps another video. When we connect these, we want to make sure that the polarity is correct. sure that the pin goes black, red, and then signal with the black being towards the center of the board. Once we get that set up, then we need to activate the relay and web control. We go to settings, we go to advanced settings, and we scroll down. Spindle automation option. And you can choose relay high or relay low. If it doesn't work, choose the other one. Relay high means it flips that pin to five volts. Relay low means it takes that pin to ground for the signal. And different relays do it differently. So you, you might want to test it first. You want to create a macro if you want to be able to turn your spindle on and off without having to run a G-code program. You go to Maslow settings and then in the macro area, make one for on and off. On would be the G code command M3, off would be the G code command M5. Then when you click the button, it will turn your router on and off.